Yeah, sorry about that. Uh, kind of a bad situation. My memory card filled up right as I um, was in a cut scene. So it was only 30 seconds. So I decided to decided to delete that part. And basically, all I talked all I talked about was that we're going to be interrogating these two guys. Tiernan is a one. McCaffrey is a two. Yeah, Tiernan and McCaffrey. And uh, this is basically we're at the central. Okay. Why did you run? It was the last one to see Evelyn that night. I knew you would think it was me. Can you describe your relationship with Evelyn? I, I barely knew Evelyn. It sounds like half an answer to me, Tiernan. Were you sleeping with her? That's none of your business. Fuck. Aristotle's Metaphysics, the book that belonged to McCaffrey. McCaffrey started looking at him once, laughed in her face. You were saying Evelyn stole it. She wanted something of his. You don't like McCaffrey, do you? Fuck. He's full of the common man routine, but he props up a bar like the rest of us. Evelyn thought he was going to be a great novelist. He had nothing but vitriol for her. Fuck. You and Evelyn were drinking together last night, and she had no other place to stay. I don't know what happened last night. I, I don't remember. That's bullshit. Damn it! Reason to think differently. Damn I'm it! I'm gonna have to go to the DA. I drank half a bottle of scotch. I don't remember a goddamn thing. Fuck. Do you own a car, Tiernan? Four. I'm gonna. Hmm. Have access to a lug wrench. We use a lot of them to clear jams in the pin setting machines. I want the truth. I think you broke into McCaffrey's apartment and planted a lug wrench there. I didn't do that. And there's no way you can prove any different. Please let me let me not get this one wrong too. As hard as this is for you to contemplate, I really love Four her. of four wrong. She was kind and gentle. Evelyn was missing a ring from her right Shit. hand. Shit. It's strange. She always wore it. A uh, big black circular disc with a white E in the middle. It was made from an old typewriter key, present from the prop department of her old movie studio. I'm going to talk to McCaffrey. You need to think about what you've told us, Tiernan. You're not in the clear. Fuck. O of four correct. We're going to have to get this other guy now, or I'm fucked. Crap, okay. Where's the other one? Oh, there it is. You ready to answer some questions? Do you think I have all the answers? People who run from the police usually have something to hide. Touche, detective. Let's see where this takes us. You told us you barely knew Evelyn Summers. She hung around sometimes. I had very little to do with her. Hmm. Listen, you gotta be kidding me. It's either you or Tiernan from where we're sitting. Personally, I think Evelyn is better off. But I had nothing to do with it. 
You've got to be kidding. Evelyn died sometime around midnight. Remind me, where were you? I was at home, writing. I'm working on a manuscript. You're gonna to need to do better if you don't want to You gotta be kidding me. I was having a political meeting in my apartment. Cheese and crackers for the fifth columns. Some of these people will corroborate your story. I won't give up names of party members. Good. Your funeral. <laughs> it's either gonna be you or Tierney or Rover. Make it stick, detective. The party has good lawyers. You've got to be kidding. Oh, a six correct. This is bullshit. Fucking bullshit. Ugh. Operator, message for KGPL. Putting you through now. Phelps, batch 1247. How can I help, detective? I need the jacket on a Grover McCaffrey. That's the salient point here, isn't it? Do we have anything that... Yeah, you know what? He's lying. You're lying, McCaffrey. You have a history of violence towards women. How do you turn a couple parking tickets and a petty theft misdemeanor into an assault charge? We know all about you and your dishonorable discharge. Beating some poor woman near to death in Syracuse. You've never been in combat again. Your whole life is a fraud. She was a goddamn peasant whore! She tried to steal from my wallet. I could have fought for this country! I could have... You beat her because she stole from you. Because she tried to outsmart you. The ignorant audacity of the bitch! What is a man supposed to do? Sit there and take it? How is a man supposed to call himself a man? And Evelyn Summers, a poor, drunken nobody, stole your book. And she got what was coming to her! <laughs> Governor McCaffrey, I'm charging you with the murder of Evelyn Summers. She was a sad lady. I've never heard anyone except herself. I hope God finds a way to forgive her. Congratulations, boys, you bagged the fine catch. Another red to boot, Grant. Now, I want you to put this business about a repeat offender out of your mind. This McCaffrey creature shows no remorse, and neither will the grand jury. You would have to walk a long mile to find a better candidate for one more part of this I don't think he did it, but there's no one else that could charge. <laughs> Back off this fucking bridge! They'll start walking! 
knocking the mortars back to their own positions. We only have I'm minutes. I'm in charge here, Sergeant. Get your men off the bridge, Lieutenant. What's your unit, Sergeant? We don't have time for this, Lieutenant. What's your unit, Sergeant? My company, 22nd Marines, Lieutenant. And we just saved your ass by boarding the river. My orders are to reconnoiter the... I think that point is now moot. You have ten men left. My orders are to save what's left. Move out! Okay. But I haven't really heard too much about um his family. Mm -hmm.